When replacing a water supply valve, there are circumstances where the existing compression ring and nut will adequately perform from one valve to the next. However, sometimes the compression ring will become damaged and will need to be removed and replaced. There are two ways to remove a damaged compression ring and nut. The first and best way is to use a compression ring puller. This tool can be purchased at a hardware or plumbing supply store. The second way to remove the compression ring and nut is to use a handheld power grinder. This is, however, less recommended because of the damage that can occur to the copper pipe during grinding. The tools needed to perform this repair will either be a compression ring puller or a set of rib joint pliers, a handheld power grinder, and a flathead screwdriver, depending on the technique that will be used. To remove the compression ring and nut using the compression ring puller, First, place the coupling guide inside the tube of the copper pipe. Insert the threaded stem of the puller into the coupling and place the forks of the puller behind the compression ring and nut. Next, turn the puller handle clockwise until the compression ring and nut are pulled loose from the copper pipe. To grind the nut off of the copper water pipe, take the rib joint pliers and securely hold the compression nut with them while slowly grinding with the power grinder. It is important to evenly grind the nut without moving too close to the copper pipe, as any scoring on the copper pipe will make it more prone to leaking. Once the compression nut is mostly cut through, take the flathead screwdriver and pry the opening of the nut further apart until it is able to slide over the compression ring and off of the copper water pipe. Be careful not to touch this area, as it will most likely be hot from the grinding. With the compression nut off of the water pipe, take the handheld power grinder and begin to grind through the compression ring. Be extremely careful not to grind into the copper pipe. When the compression ring is cut enough to remove, use the flathead screwdriver and pry it loose from the copper water pipe. Now take the rib joint pliers and remove the compression ring off of the pipe. Now that both the compression ring and nut are completely removed from the water supply pipe, a new water supply valve can be installed.